Hi everyone. Um, so this is my video for unboxing of the Period Store um, November 2014. And I guess technically it's not really an unboxing since I've already opened it, but whatever. So this is for November for the Period Store. And you've got your card, and it gives you information on the treat that you get, and the art. And for my feminine product this month, I ordered wet wipes. And this is how big it is, or I should say how small it is. Um, I guess I was expecting something bigger, and I was honestly expecting, um, like individual, um, like individually wrapped wipes. And these are 20 wipes. Um, and y'all, a couple weeks ago I went to the Dollar General and got like 80 baby wipes for a dollar. Um, and the way they priced this for me this month is my regular, um, plan or whatever is $20 um, but if you order like certain specialty items I guess they go off of the base rate of $15 which is if you had only gotten uh, treats and tea and pain medicine and art so that package is $15 and then they added on $3.99 for these. So basically for the art and the chocolate and the tea and the little packages of uh, ibuprofen, that's $15. And then they charge me $3.99 for this. So in the envelope, which is already open, we've got our art which is actually kind of cool and then we did get a bonus item which they talk about on the card minty herbal pads infused with lavender rose how tuina mint and aloe these pads are sure to cause a sensation yeah sensation in your panties because they have mint in them isn't that going to make your hoo-ha tingly? I don't know. I haven't opened it. Because I'm not... Uh, I'm not sure. Um, it seems like it's really big, too. Is it just one? Or are there more than one? I don't know. But... Um... Okay, so it gives you a rundown of the herbal ingredients on the back, and it says rose is for pain relief. I'm sorry, y'all, but the stuff that they infuse into the pad is not going to travel up the vagine and into the uterus to, like, ease your cramps. So, I'm not sure about these, but I'll, I'll give them a try. We'll see. I'll let you know if my hoo-ha tingles. Unless you don't want to know, because that's probably TMI. So then we get our three little packages of pills. And then, I think I got two of these. Two packages of tea. Um, but like I said, I already opened this, like, a week ago. And so I may have already... Uh, drunk, drink, the other bag of tea. And then, this is probably the one item that I'm really excited about. Pumpkin caramel chocolate. That looks pretty good. Handcrafted in Brooklyn, New York by Tumbador Chocolate. So that, to me, looks very delicious. Um... So, I have decided to go ahead and um, quit this box 
Um, I deactivated my account yesterday. It's just really, it's not worth the money. I gave it, this is the fourth month. I said I would give it three months, and then I guess I was feeling generous, and I gave it, you know, four months. Um, it's just really not worth the money. You know, it's it's kind of cool to, to get stuff like this that, you know, I didn't even know existed. Um, the art is little postcard size thingies that I really don't know what I'm going to do with them. So, um, yeah, I've decided to go ahead and quit the period store. It's probably not a surprise to those of you who, who've been, <laughs> who've been watching my videos, um, since the beginning. Um, the very first box I got, I was disappointed with. Um, so y'all probably saw it coming. Um, but... You know, if you want to give it a try, who knows? Maybe the next boxes will be fantastic and I'm missing out because I quit. But I kind of doubt it. So, anyways, thanks for watching my fourth and final video for unboxing for the period store. Thanks for watching. Bye.